Hi, my name is Misty Wagner and I'm your personal acting business coach and I'm going to give you a lot of information about this industry. Visit my website, actingbusinesscoach.com. This video is going to go over wardrobe for talent and it's always interesting to see what folks wear to auditions. Every once in a while we do get to see what you're either doing a self-tape with or a casting director will send us um, some samples of a day just because they're a little frustrated with what happened. And so while we're looking at that, we're also looking at your wardrobe and thinking, oh my God, why did they wear that? So um, I'm here to help you with that. So. Um, as an agent, um, like I said, I mean, it's this is one of those things that comes up often. I actually do consultations with my other company, and I will have people bring in their wardrobe or photos of them in their wardrobe just so they can get some second opinion and advice. Uh, the biggest thing with that is no logos, no Under Armour, no Nike, no Billabong. None of that will work for this. You definitely can't have any neon, so no neon green, pinks, oranges will not work for this. And it's also important that if you have lost weight, that you get new clothes that fit you. If you've gained weight, that you get new clothes that fit you. Um, it's important that you also make sure that you have some character wardrobe. So if you're in an age or demographic where you could be auditioning for a nurse or a doctor, for example, then make sure you have some nurse scrubs and a lab coat. Uh, those are things that your agent would go with you, go over with you normally, or somebody like uh, me with my business. Um, I do consultations, and like I said, thirty dollars an hour. I go over a lot of information in that time, and this is one of those things that does come up, and, and people have actually um, seeked out some help for. So. I recommend you look at commercials, you look at TV shows and film, and see what they're wearing. That gives you the best indication. And this is an expensive wardrobe, and it's a wardrobe you can still wear. It's not that you can't wear it out you know, other places. So your actor's wardrobe, your actor's portion of your closet is not something that's off limits, but it is something that you do wanna make sure you have set aside and you've put some time and effort into. I personally recommend going to like a, a Walmart, a Ross, a Target, um, Kohl's, all of those places have uh, solid color, generic shirts, sweaters, jackets, um, hoodies, things like that that don't always have brands on them and logos on them and words on them. So that's really important. You shouldn't have like this whole thing across your chest like school's cool or you know whatever. I mean just make sure that you have you know solid colors, polos, button downs, if you have tattoos, I highly recommend, especially if they're on your lower arm, that you invest in long sleeve shirts. So that is a real big deal. Um, not all my clients want to see tattoos in their shots, and it's in your best interest to try to make sure they're not seen in most auditions unless it goes with the actual character and role. So take time to invest some money into your wardrobe. Think about what you're going to wear as an actor, what colors complement you. Um, could be like sage green or burnt orange, purples, pinks. Uh, try to avoid the black, white, uh, green, and red, um, you know, especially if you're up against a green screen. So that matters. Otherwise, green's a great color for most people. Um, but, you know, you got to pay attention to those details. And it's also important that you have them all ready for you for the next day for when you have an audition or a job. So there will be times where you are booked on a job and the client will request you to bring some of your own wardrobe. So this is one of those um, moments that you're like, oh my gosh, what? I got to bring my wardrobe? So please take time to have at least a little bit of a selection for our clients and for you for when you are going out to auditions and jobs.